G'day guys and welcome back. Today we're watching my friend play futsal and he's playing in the first division in Germany here. So the first division in Germany is broken up into regions and probably because of a lack of funding, there's no national competition. In the region that Marvin's playing, he's top of the table and there's a big difference between the top teams and the bottom teams. For example, his team have beaten some teams by 20 goals. Five seconds. Two nil after two minutes. It's going to be a long day for Eintracht Magdeburg. Three nil in three minutes. <laughs> So half time, it's 12 nil. Wow. So what I noticed with futsal is that the players, they control with the sole of their foot. And I think that's for better control than rather on the inside of the foot. So when I mean sole, I mean on this part. And then what I've also noticed is that many times they want to shoot quickly. So they shoot with the front part of their foot, where the toe is. All right, guys, notice the kickoff here. It's a bit different. They pass it to the other team, and then it goes back. So the final score was 21-0, total, complete annihilation. The Hohenstein team, they've got a lot of international players from Poland, Russia, Ukraine, Brazil. The goalkeeper was even playing for the German national team, so a lot of experience and too good for Eintracht Magdeburg today. Hey guys, welcome back. So Marvin, his team won 21-0. And today, I'm just talking futsal with him and learning so much about the league. So Marvin, thank you for the interview. What is your football history? Ну, в 5 лет мне начал заниматься футболом. Меня мама отвезла на футбол. И до 11 лет я был футболистом. Потом ушел в футзал. До 15 лет был в Львове в футзале. И уехал в Лиссабон. Сейчас я здесь, в Германии, в Хохенштайне. How did you become a futsal player in Germany? Ну, я приехал сюда, мне помог, я пришел на футбол, и мне помог один человек, он связал меня с агентом, и агент мне помог Михаил, что я очень благодарен ему. What happens at futsal training? Ну, мы много пасуемся, начинаем в квадраты играть, постоянно почти с мячами, на физику очень, ну, бывает однажды в неделю на физику, а так всегда больше на тактику и на работу с мячами. What do you need to become a good futsal player? Ну, самое для меня важное это начать быстрее думать и отдавать пасы хорошие. Ну и немного выучить немецкий язык, это очень важно. So do you have any other tips for other players? Ну, самое главное за собой глядеть много, классно восстанавливаться, сильно в пас играть больше, думать головой, тактически быть подкованным. Много видео очень надо смотреть на своих кумиров, чтобы смотреть, как они играют и также играть. 